We're good. Hi, uh, we are. Um, uh, we are. I'm we are diverse. Impressions for the next amount of time. Tim. Perfect. All right, guys. So we'll go into the first fan question. What was your favorite moment on set behind the scenes in this film so far? If there's one. <clears throat> um, trying to keep a straight face. Uh, when, throughout. Throughout the movie. Yeah. No, when 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 we were all. Uh, all uh, at the end, that was quite difficult. Wasn't it? That on was the roof? Fun. Yeah, on the roof. You know, there's an end <laughs> shot, and we, we can uh, physically do it without laughing. And if you look very closely, I think you can see. You can all of our faces are sort of like. <laughs> Is there anyone like in the cast that's always trying to like make someone laugh in between scenes? I don't know that it's intentionally trying to make people laugh, except for that this, for some reason the second they start seeing action, if sometimes we make premature eye contact, <laughs> or other people make premature eye contact. You just lose it. Yeah. Amazing. Um, okay, if you could take one cast member with you to go beyond the wall, who would you choose and why? I would choose you because I feel like you, he, well, if we're, we're talking about like survival situations, mm -hmm. I feel like you would be the most adept in that kind of a situation scenario. Um, I think, yeah, if you're talking about survival, I'd mm -hmm. probably choose Shay as well because I think. Uh, Others might die quickly if they had to. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> they had to be in the element. Yeah. Um, so yeah. Okay, perfect. Um, Theo, did you get any injuries since you had so many fighting scenes in this film? I hit my head. Uh, did you? Yeah, yeah. In that little. Oh yeah. Craft thing. I was supposed to grab onto something, but at the last minute, I missed it, and I, I just went head first into the wall, basically. That's awful. It was fine. Actually, it was fine. I kind of felt tired. Lit a cigarette. Two concussions are great. Yeah, <laughs> exactly. Possible brain brain damage. <laughs> Who gives a fuck? Um, Shailene, another fan asked, "What is it like playing such a strong female lead that influences so many young girls like myself?" Oh. Oh. Um. The thing I love about Tris is yes, she's strong, and yes, she's empowering and um, uh, brave. But at the same time, she still has a lot of weaknesses and she still has a lot of things that she struggles with, including vulnerability and admitting to when she's wrong. And I think it's important to note that we're all, you know, we all have so many conflicting emotions within ourselves. We're never just one thing. And to me, that's why she was the most inspiring and empowering was because she was a great example of how to be strong and yet how to also accept the fact that she's still human and, um, and we're all human and we're all going to be going through complex trials and tribulations throughout our internal workings and our internal world. Perfect. Um, what is both of your fondest memories from filming this film? Uh, we filmed in Atlanta which was really hot but also nice because when we had days off or on the weekends we could go to the lake and hang out or there's a lot of outdoor activities that um, you could get involved with in that particular region of the south that was my favorite i mean on set you know different things but in off time downtime i agree cool good answer activities <laughs> Um, did either of you take anything from any of the sets of any of the films so far? No. I never <laughs> do you have plans to? No, well, I never, te I never tend to do that. I don't know why. I'm, I've never been into, like, memorabilia yeah. uh, from, from anything. So, so. I stole a pair of boots from the last movie. Really? Yeah, because yeah. they fit perfectly, and they were worn in, and it was winter time, and I needed a pair of boots because I didn't have one. Mm. Oh, actually, I probably stole some underwear. Yeah. Oh, yeah. I've stolen a few pairs of underwear as yeah. well. Amazing. Um, Shailene, you travel a lot, so what would you say has been your favorite destination so far that you've been? I don't think that there's one. Um, I really love Europe and love um, London in particular. Um, yes. Love the UK, but love London. I do. That city is so, ugh, such a good city. Um, yeah, I don't know. Every place offers something different, so I don't know that I can pinpoint one place. Cool. Um, what's the best advice you guys have ever gotten that sort of like sticks with you with life and like helps you? Keep your head up. <laughs> <laughs> I, I always say this from my mum. Um, under promise, oversell. You do say that. 
she'll be watching. Thanks. I don't think she will, but no. she might be. Hmm. So in case, just in case. Um, what's something that's always helped you guys to stay grounded throughout all of this? Um, <laughs> I don't know. You know, I think it's hard to answer that question because I, for myself, don't know, A, what being grounded is relative to everyone's unique experience. Um, and I think for me and for us, if I'm going to include you in this, but like our lifestyles haven't really changed too much because of these movies. So I think that whatever grounded means for us is is synonymous with our lifestyle um, and the lifestyle that we lived before these movies started and, and how they exist now. And obviously small things have shifted because we've shifted as human beings just inevitably over the last three years. Um, but for the most part... The constants that were there before, like the Yeah, exactly, and the friends. same constants. Yeah. Cool. Um, a fan asks, Theo, after this movie franchise is over, what will you miss most about working with Shaylee? Oh, so many things. Um, every single thing. <laughs> um, having a partner in crime, yo. No, it's good to have someone uh, that was kind of painful, wasn't it? <laughs> someone uh, that have, having your back, mm -hmm. I'd say. Awesome. Cool. So now we're going to take some live from fans that are asking now. Are we going to hear their voices? Yeah. No, well, unfortunately, no, because they're <laughs> typing. But You're going to hear we'll my see voice. Them. Yeah. yeah. Um, okay, someone asked, what was the most emotionally tiring and physically tiring thing you had to do for the movie? I always say this, and I will continue to always say this, but running was just the most exhausting thing for me. But you know what? Actually, no, we had a scene that we talked about um, yes. before where Tristan and Four arrive in a conflict and um, have a disagreement and ultimately go different directions for a, a hot minute and that was a hard scene to sort of structurally figure out um, yeah. there was a lot of uh, exposition that had to be told in that scene but also trying to make it feel grounded and truthful to our characters that was difficult that was hard yeah I would agree 100% great yeah. um, okay here's another one if you could be a mythical <laughs> no contact <laughs> no contact <laughs> Creature, what would you be? Um, saber tooth tiger. Is that mythical? I was gonna no. say, I don't think you're that's right, mythical. it's not mythical. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, in any way, so it, fine, it so existed. Fine. Yeah. Uh, if you were to go back to the ice age, you <laughs> would be a saber tooth tiger. I would be a mermaid, I think, because I want to be able to swim down to like the depths of the sea. Okay, I would be a unicorn. Would you? Not really, but that was the only kind of creature I could think of. Uh, I would definitely be a mermaid because then I could breathe underwater. Maybe I'd be uh, a cyclops. I feel like you would like, oh yeah, that's underwater as well. No, like, you know, from uh, Homer's Odyssey or whatever, and he's like, whoa. Uh, you know. Well, yeah. what about, what about, um, I feel like you would want to be a mermaid mm. because you love the ocean. Yeah, that would be cool, yeah. But he wants to be a cyclops, so that's okay. <laughs> Cool. I see another movie, Mermaid Cyclops movie. Yeah, yeah. Totally um, okay, and last one. Uh, what was your, what's your Fair. favorite thing? <laughs> so romantic. <laughs> <laughs> what's your favorite thing about your characters? This is the last question. Um, I love that Trace is open to various hairstyles. <laughs> I think that's really great. Um, um, and I love forced tight t shirts. Everyone loves wears tight t shirts. <laughs> Solid answers. All right, okay. awesome. Thank yeah. you guys so much. Thank you. Au revoir. <laughs>